It is literally writing code faster than anything I've ever seen before. This is one of the fastest models I've ever seen. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for being with me today. Today, we're going to talk about Claude and Claude's 3.7 model that just came out. It is one of the best chatting models that came out recently. We know that Claude with their 3.5 Sonnet model was one of the best coding models out there. But we're going to focus on adding Claude 3 Sonnet with the reasoning model, with its extended reasoning onto VS Code. If you open up VS Code and you go in here and you go to the Ask Copilot section and you try to choose 3.7, you cannot see it. And the reason why is because it's only provided in their paid model. So we want to add Cloud 3.7 to use without paying a monthly subscription. And the best extension for that is obviously your root code it kind of is an add-on that allows vs code to act like cursor without having the need to pay 20 dollars a month all you have to do is use your own api keys how do you add the Claude 3.7 Sonnet, and then you're gonna see build with Claude right here. We're gonna do start building. You'll go to the console here, always go to the settings tab or the API keys tab, and you'll see your API just create a key, and then you will have to, and then you'll have to add $5 minimum so you can start using this. Once you've gotten your key, you're gonna go down here, you're gonna go to extensions, you're gonna search for Roo, you're gonna see Roo code, and then you're gonna install it, and then you're gonna see the small rocket ship right here. Now, after that, you wanna go to the api provider you're going to choose anthropic you're going to paste your url and then you're going to add the model that you want now i'm going to use the thinking model um you're going to give it a budget but one thing i really want you to add is enable experimental checkpoints and that's because sometimes these ai models start drifting apart or drifting away from the actual requirements and then ruin the code or ruin the app and crash the app so we're just going to do that we're going to save right here after you're done we can click off ask copilot and then we can go to root code click on here here. I like to do this test all the time. I like to do a simple uh, water tracking app. So I just added this small command. Now, now once I've written this, uh, we can just go ahead and send it out and it creates checkpoints for you, just like we enabled. So you can go back if something messes up. I'm just going to add this because I want to make sure that we're adding a nice UI to this. And as you can see here, what I like about root code is it gives you the cost that you're spending. This costed us 0.01 or 0.05 cents. So, and you're also seeing how many tokens you're spending and sending. As you can see, it's writing um, CSS. It's astonishing how fast this is. As you can see, it's removing stuff, adding stuff instantly, thinking through it, using the reasoning model. This is probably the fastest AI model I've ever seen add code into a editor. Wow, it's so fast. I This is the first time I see this do it that, wow. I'm actually shocked. This is the first time I really use it. Like, okay, so we're almost done. As you can see, we're clearing out all the errors right now. Now, it's just making sure everything's good. So now it's running the app. It's good to go. As you can see, this is a pretty cool water tracker. So you have the uh, water intakes by time, and then you have a week graph, shows you every day of the week, and you have the month graph. What's interesting is it's clicking through and then trying out the app by like making. So the AI is trying out the app on the uh, extension and making sure it's working so yeah this is the agent like capability that we're seeing so it tested everything and then working well yep that's it right there task completed uh, i've built a complete water tracking application helps you monitor your white wa like water intake throughout the day and month the apps create use types of react that the features that's all it takes that's how you add claude 3.7 into root code into vs code really fast how much did it cost us to build that app it was about we started with four dollars and 89 cents it's about a dollar and 45 cents to create this entire app this whole thing costed a dollar 45 cents that's all for today thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video it's really cool what we're seeing nowadays how fast fast these AI agents and AI models are getting. If you watch the videos from the past where we were using these things and they were slow, they were, you know, making a lot of mistakes and such, but now they're really quick. They're awesome. They've got nice design. They use nice design practices to create attractive websites for humans. And we saw some crazy stuff like taking a screenshot of the website to see the visual elements and actually trying to click through and clicking on our app to see if the functionality is working usually in the past you had to as a human 
click and use the app to make sure it's working now they've also automated this part so you don't even have to do that and make sure the app is working it'll just do it for you that's all for this video today thank you so much for watching once some more i'm on my way to get 20,000 subscribers by the end of this year and you know only you guys can do this so please subscribe help me reach that goal i'm almost at 11,000 subscribers which is absolutely incredible when i first started this channel thank you so much i'll see you on the next one and be safe be well